Today is Friday, August 28, 2020. Anthony Flanders, Market Minutes go. Well, P's at a little higher. Had a little bit of indecision during the day, trading on both sides of the market, but did manage to close a smidge higher. And hey, you know what? That keeps him at all time high. So far, so good. Let's take a look at the NASDAQ. Well, not quite all time highs, but eh, one afternoon away, I guess, down about a third of a percent. Of course, these indices will correct at some point in time. They might actually be healthy for them to do so. Rusty actually ended up a smidge, kind of consolidating in here. So far, so good. Reached a little breakout, remains intact. Gold and commodity, opening gap, reversal. Longer term, still looks pretty good. I'd like to see it take out 190 and beyond vis-a-vis -vis the GLD ETF. Ditto for silver. Gold and silver stocks following suit. Just make sure you wait for entries there in light of the recent pullback. Take a look Take a look at health services, he tried to say. Break it out to new highs in here. A few areas lagging like biotech, but for the most part, most areas still looking pretty good in here. So what we do? Well, just keep following along. Any questions? DaveDaveLandry.com. I'm Dave Landry, and you start to watch